Hello YouTubers and welcome to another video. We've got the middle of the way, middle of the way, middle of the camp vlog update today. We've got Will on Fortnite. Oh yeah. He brought his PlayStation to entertain himself and us. He is a roommate for this camp while we go through and train. We've got a lovely sunset. Tried to get the time lapse up. <laughs> and we've got Mr. Peter Chambers next door as well. <laughs> anyway, today is an update of the camp and what's going on. So, so far we have trained for approximately a week. That's approximately half of the camp done. I think we're actually eight days. I don't know what day it is. I think it's a Sunday. So approximately eight days in and, or seven days in and it's been interesting. So came up here in November, did a lot of erging, did a lot of weights and came back really tired and then got the thick air down and sea level recovered well did well in a 2k and, and whatnot after that and now back up the mountain not going too hot again we've had a lot of erging a lot of weights and this time we've had a little bit of cycling as well because there's guys uh, as other guys are at a cycling camp on the team so we've decided to mix up the training for a little bit of variety because remember variation is a key to motivation but like I said, this camp hasn't been too hot. It's been a little bit different in volume wise, intensity wise, really trying to get in the good training. And there has been a little bit of wobbles here and there. Last time on the camp, I mentioned that the you want the splits, it varies for everyone, but you want the splits to be with like in a good range of UT2, maybe two, three splits to start with and then bring it down and hopefully be at your UT2 this time it's been a bit more difficult to do that and it's just a case of almost so if you imagine you're in the water and you're you're treading water and you want to keep your head above the water so pretty much at that stage just now making sure i'm training as smart as possible but making sure i'm getting the training done so it's really good really important for me to talk to the coaches how i'm feeling so one thing we do is take our heart rate uh, our hydration levels in the morning uh, to gauge how our body is doing, not necessarily how we're feeling. So sometimes your heart rate can be way out, out, all over the place, but you actually feel all right and your heart rate is trying to tell you something. And the opposite, you may feel terrible, but your heart rate is in a good range. So you have to sort of take all those things into consideration when you're doing quite high volume. Unfortunately, or fortunately, depending on you look at it, there's not a lot of snow this time. So we've been able to get out on the track every day for some fresh air activities, which is absolutely fantastic as always. And we have made it past halfway of the camp. So from going onwards, I've mentioned before about doing the weekly episodes, and this is sort of the start of said weekly episode as a update. I'm videoing uh, or making the film that I want to do for Sierra Nevada. Um, Pretty much got a lot of the film that I want to put into it, into the film, but not quite the uh, main part that I want to put in. So I'm basically trying to make it, to make people, or let people know what it's like up here at Sierra Nevada, what it's like to train, but also not, like, a more serious one than normal, but also not a boring serious one, if you know what I mean by that. But let me know in the comments below, if there's any questions you may like to hear answered, and they could be a difficult question, or they could be an easy question, but we'll see if I can include any of those questions in the film documentary kind of thing that I'm trying to do. Basically, I'm trying to interview the guys that are here and get their opinions on Sierra Nevada through different questions and whatnot. But like I said, the questions are still trying to be decided and we've got the coaches running around the track with the sunset in the background absolutely delightful and that will be it for today's or this week's episode just a little update so basically from now until next week I'm going to try and get back so i'm not just sort of treading water so i'm above the water and i'm trying to get the film ready and posted maybe by next week but we will soon find out fingers crossed on that one and as always yam squad hopefully you've had an awesome week we'll see you next week i might be posting another video i have another idea or 
a plan to do a 10 hour video at some point, but I'm not sure if the computer that I have with me can handle exporting 16 gig files. But we'll see. As always, once again, Yam Squad, hopefully you've enjoyed the update. Let me know in the comments below what you've been up to this week. And remember to subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that like button and have a good one. Yeah!